Earth Day is coming up tomorrow, but there are ways we can all help the planet outside of this annual observance. 13's Brent Palmer went to the Topeka Zoo to learn more today. Brent. Dennis Dinwiddie from the Topeka Zoo gave out some tips for how you can celebrate while leaving an impact on our community. Earth Day is a time for celebrating and protecting the natural world. That protection can start here in Topeka. Being a great environmental steward here in Topeka impacts on the environment far beyond the boundaries of Topeka. So everything that any of us do to help the environment is something we're doing to help the environment, not just here in Topeka, Shawnee County, but well beyond that as well. Dennis Dinwiddie states that everything in nature is connected, especially our waterways. The Kansas dumps into the Missouri River. The Missouri River dumps in the Mississippi. The Mississippi dumps in the open ocean through the Gulf of Mexico. So if we stop putting toxins of all kinds in, in our storm drains, it protects 153 miles of Kansas River, plus the Missouri, plus the Mississippi, plus open ocean. To combat pollution of the system, you can volunteer at the Topeka Zoo to redecorate manhole covers. We're taking them all up across Topeka, turning them into works of art just like this, and that way people will grow up now. Kids will grow up seeing the sign, no dumping drains to river, and sooner or later that will kind of impact on them in a more permanent way. And then when they're changing their oil in the driveway someday, they'll know better to dump it down that drain. There are other ways to volunteer here in town. Uh, Friends of the Caw, an organization that cares deeply and works hard to protect the Kansas River and this watershed. Looking for volunteers on the cleanup days that they do, on the river cleanup days. You can also change your environmental impact in other ways, starting with what you do at home. Right now in springtime, as we're making plans for planting our lawns, you know, our yards, our gardens, and our properties, we can make choices on what we plant that beautify our yard and also support pollinators, monarch butterflies and all kinds of other pollinators. The Topeka Zoo will hold an Earth Day celebration tomorrow from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. They will have over 60 booths and activities within the zoo that will teach people of all ages about conservation. Good advice tonight, Brent. Thanks for the report there.